though our mission isn't open, we have helped people in different ways. And uh, here's a prime example was when um, it was like September 10th or something, the second week of September, and we had a couple come, and they just wanted a, um, a, a shower at the Y, and somebody told them that they've been in their aging expedition for the past 10 months. They came from Salt Lake City, and they came here, and then they were, so, so we were, so they came up to our office, and our office is at 123 East Park Street, and our office is upstairs and the mission office. And that's the thrift store down below. So anyhow, they came up and they, s and, uh, they asked for showers. And, and so we, it's $2 a piece at the YMCA and they provide a towel and we gave them some hygiene products. And they were, they were elated that they had this kind of help. And then, um, and they also asked for a gas card because they, they were out of gas, truly. And, or they were near, nearly out. So, and then Rocky gave her, I, I think that, and then $20 to get some groceries. Well, some of it they had to buy pet food for their dog. Oh, God. Because their dog's starving. So then, like, uh, after the weekend, they came back and, and they said, you know, we, in fact, the gal called me and said that um, they had to have spent some of that money on the dog. And so Rocky said that the um, Humane Society has free dog food or pet food, whatever. And so I drove them. I drove her over there and got two of these, you know, two pound, two and a half pound buckets of dog food and about you know, twenty five of the milk going treats. And she was, she, she literally had tears in her eyes. It's just like, oh. Muffy or whatever the dog's name is. I mean, she's just this this huge relief that, that her family pet right. could, you know, could have some food. It's just, and so then um, got her another gas card. And they had run out of the gas over by across from Butte Central High School. I mean, it was just like, uh, so that's and that's just a little way. And then um, finally. But what happened is um, we had had a renter. We, Butte Rescue Mission has um, what used to be Clapman's Corner. People who've grown up in Butte would know where that is. It's directly across the street from um, the, our, the old Second Street Mission, and it's on Emma and Second Street, and it's it's a two-story red brick building. And it's pretty weather-beaten and old, and just like all of us. <laughs> and so, in the lower level is. A, the warehouse that we have for storing food. Even even now we use it and we have six freezers full of meat that we've gotten, you know, donated or whatever. So when we open again, we'll be we'll have that much ahead. We have rice, beans, crackers and all aging. But there's still food and we're right, not gonna right. waste it. So anyhow, then we went to um, the after after that we had a renter in one of the two apartments upstairs who hadn't really paid his rent in 18 months and it was just like, you know, he's drinking his check, it's just time to get him out of there because we have two people who could use it. And after we had a heroic effort <laughs> in cleaning it, um, our office manager cleaned it and, that, and uh, when Rocky told them, they were up in the office, and when she told them that, he, that uh, they could rent it, again, this woman was just jumping up and down, tears streaming down her face, just like, you know, and she said, we don't have to be homeless anymore.